Kids, let me tell you a famous tale from Java, Indonesia. Long, long time ago, there was a prosperous kingdom called Pajajaran. A little family was lived in the kingdom. A king who was very kind and loved by his people and his daughter, Dewi Kadita, who was famous for her beauty and kindness, who was not only loved by their people, even spirits around her also have a heart for her kindness and beauty. One day, Dewi Kadita and her father were alone, and she felt the king's restlessness, so she asked what happened. And the king answered that he is having a dilemma. He doesn't have a son while his one true love passed away long ago. Dewi Kadita understands her father's problem and let her father to remarry again for his happiness. The king's eyes were teary and he hugged his beloved daughter tightly. Not long after that, the king marries a woman from neighboring kingdom. Dewi Mutiara was her name. They were also blessed with a healthy son. However, Dewi Mutiara was worried that Dewi Karita could take the throne before her son did. So one rainy night, she went to a powerful shaman who lives deep in the jungle far from the kingdom. And later in the morning, Raja Pajajaran and Dewi Mutiara heard a scream from Dewi's Kadita room. Bubons are seen everywhere on her skin and she look horrible. No one is able to heal her, and thus, they don't have any choice but to go with Dewi's Mutiara's suggestion, that is, to banish her away from the kingdom. Dewi Kadita walked and walked to the south for three days straight until Hmm? What's that noise? She followed a noise that keeps calling her, and there, she was guided to a beach. It happens that the voice belongs to the spirit of the sea. Spirit offers to heal her, but in exchange, she has to be the ruler of the southern sea. And so she accepts, thinking that no one loves her anymore, that even her own father banished her. And until now, she's living under the southern Java Sea. And so, that's all one of the tales of Indonesia. Let's go to sleep.